Greetings and salutations, YouTube. Casual Flacker here, back for episode number four of our Pokemon Heart Gold and nope, it's just Heart Gold. Pokemon Heart Gold randomized Nuzlocke. Um, in the last episode, we got a bunch more encounters. Navied it over to Violet City, got us a few eggs. Um, and in this episode, we are going to do um, Sprout Tower and take on the gym. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. Like I said, I wasn't going to hatch the eggs until we got the Togepi egg, or the egg that is originally Togepi. So once we do that, we'll be in, we'll be in pretty good shape. <sighs> Alright, Sprout Tower, let's see what you have in store for us. Probably going to do a lot of battling in here just so I can get some levels on these guys. We're a bit underleveled for Faulkner. I don't necessarily know if I'm going to be looking for battles, but... All right, we'll battle every trainer in here, that's for sure. Psybeam. I really wish Cresselia had Psybeam instead of Confusion, but take what we can get. Seattle is now level 7. Nope, we will stay in on a trap inch. So I ended up doing a lot more bulk recording of this series than I thought I would. Probably what will happen is I'll end... This is probably the last one I'll do because I can't keep more than around, uh, like, four videos at a time on my, uh, on my computer. I don't have the storage space for it. Um, and this, I think, is the fourth episode... This should be the fourth episode I have recorded, yeah, because this is episode four. Oh, dang, now we're just straight up not here. That's interesting. We're really getting these texture glitches. Oh, a max potion. You know, these texture glitches have been very, very prevalent in this playthrough, and I don't I don't really know why. So everything in here is going to be on the same strength level as a uh, as a bell sprout. Hence the Oddishes, the Trap Inches, Horsey, stuff like that. Which right now really isn't a problem because they're still giving decent experience. And I'm really... For these regulators, it'll be kind of an issue at first because they're still going to have like really weak mons. But once we get up into the, the gym leaders and Elite Four, I do think it's worth it. I mean, you saw the... I think as I'm, as I'm recording this, the video, or the two finale videos went up earlier this morning. No, Joey, I don't have time to talk. An old Amber. Well, you know what that means. That is a new Ingress. At some point. I will probably do it in the area with the highest level mods. Actually, you know what I'm going to end up doing? Back to that area where it was. So I'm going to see if I can find it. <laughs> the larva. Uh, I don't know if what larva are. For sure. Alright, maybe we won't switch. It was. Strength to a Pidgey is Pidgey, Spiro, Rattata, stuff like that. So you don't have a whole lot of options. 
I never noticed that the clouds moving around. Maybe that's the first time I've ever been in this gym at that time. I'm guessing that's not like we're going to see something fun. Ha! He outsped me. That's even mean, I guess. Ooh, a crit. Ooh, that's good. And a Magby. I'll stand. Oh, his Mag Magby is level 13. And I got burned. All right, well, that's enough of this. We have an auxiliary for this. That's weird. Magby is considered similar strength to a Pidgeotto. Maybe it is stat-wise. I don't know, because I guess Mag Magmar would be a to be a Pidgeotto. I don't know, that still feels weird. Well, we've done it, kitties. We've taken out the first gym leader and earned our first badge. Oh, I meant to give him a voice. Oh, well. I can tell you there will be one specific gym leader that will get a voice. Mainly because a very good one for him that I can actually do consistent. Except that's not actually roost. Onward to Azalea Town. I literally have no other options. Oh, okay. Flamethrower. Do I want to go ahead and teach this to Rapidash? Assuming it can learn it. It can't. <laughs> Rapidash must not be able to learn Flamethrower by level up. Well, then here's hoping that we get a different fire type on. Yes, Professor Allen, what do you want? Hello, Flacker. We've discovered something. The details are, well, I can't really say anything, but we want you to carry that egg. My assistant is at the Pokemart in Violet City. Could you go meet him and pick up that egg? Nope, nope, nope. Don't want to actually get into a conversation with my mother. Texture glitches. Okay, talk to the dude. Okay, so we are about ready to wrap this episode up. Um, in between episodes, we are going to um, hatch all four of the eggs that we have. Um, and after that, we'll decide on the team. We know three of the eggs. Um, one of them was a Tropius, one of them was a Spiritomb, and one was a Machoke. We don't know what this one is. I don't think. I don't think it's going to tell us. So yeah, in between episodes, I'll hatch all the eggs, and I will probably do some grinding. Um, we'll figure out what team we want. I'm selling the TM for Grass Whistle. I don't need it. Uh, yeah, we'll figure out what the team is going to be exactly. I'm not going to sell that TM yet, or I'm not going to sell that Old Amber yet. How many Pokeballs do I have? I have 17. I have to buy these in groups of... Okay. So we can buy two potions. We will come back uh, when in the next episode whenever we sell that right on the old amber. Okay, so here's hoping that the recording actually worked. It's up to ten minutes now.
It appears to actually be functioning properly now. But this episode has got to be longer than ten minutes. Oh, okay, kimono girl. I forgot about that. Me, oh my. That egg must be... I see. So it's handed from Mr. Pokemon to Professor Elm, then from Professor Elm to you. Now I get it. That egg is truly an important egg. Please do take good care of it for me. Is that understood? Well, oh, there's probably going to be like a Caterpie in here or something. I'm counting on you. Alrighty then. So, I think we are going to wrap up the episode here. And like I said, those between episodes, I'll get the eggs hatched. I'll grind up and get the team probably to about level somewhere between 10 and 13. I don't think grinding on wild mons is going to be too big of an issue around here. Um, and then the, in the next episode, we'll work our way down, hopefully all the way through uh, Union Cave. I think, yeah, Union Cave, that's what it's called. Um, yeah, guys, I, I hope that y'all are enjoying the series. I hope that you enjoy this episode. Um, I'm having even more fun recording this one than I was Fire Red, uh, just because, like I've said before, I love Heart Gold. Um, it's one of the better Pokemon games to me. Um, Black and White is my personal favorite, but Heart Gold is probably number two. Um, so yeah, we'll have a good time with this. Um, but this has been Casual Flacker saying bye bye